Hi there, so today I wanted to share with you uh, about my hair care. A lot of you on Instagram have asked me about what I do with my hair, so I'm, I'm gonna share with you exactly that. I sway a lot more towards the more natural brands when it comes to, to actually skin, makeup and hair. Uh, so I've chosen one, two, three, four, five brands that I really, really love and I'm genuinely using and I'd kind of be lost without. So I'm going to run through individual products. As you can probably see, I kind of like a bit of bounce to my hair. I do kind of put a curl through it. I like to be quite minimal. I don't have loads of time to be sorting stuff. So I want products that are actually going to work. So first up, a Vader. Around for years, and you will see by the size of these, I buy them in bulk. I love their Be Curly shampoo and conditioner. It does exactly what it says on the tin. It kind of gives you that weightless bounce. It helps take some of the fur out. The conditioner is quite a light textured conditioner. Um, so, you know, if it's for an everyday hair wash and, and condition, I find those work really nicely. Next up, uh, Living Proof, a brand I've been a huge fan of for a very long time. I love their kind of ethos when it comes to ingredients and kind of what they're doing. Simple, but really effective. So I've got, it's a Perfect Hair Day Triple Detox Shampoo. I find I work in London uh, the majority of the time. This is kind of all about removing hard water buildup and kind of pollution from your hair. I think this is something that so many people, no matter what hair type you have, whether it's fine or thick, or thin or curly or straight uh, I think this is kind of a, a shampoo that at some point you might actually like to give a go if you're living in a city so that is a current favorite it's kind of good for supporting the scalp health as well then I love their uh, full conditioner it's a weightless hydrating conditioner it does exactly what it says on the tin uh, a nice light texture again so good for all hair types so those two are a little bit more for all hair types whereas my kind of first choice the Aveda it's purely for that kind of be curly and giving it a bounce another brand that I've only recently come across actually and I get these with my online shopping my food shopping and that's kind of where I came across this brand they're called Hask I'd not heard of the brand before so I just kind of put in in my search option with my kind of vegetables and everything else I wanted uh, a natural hair product uh, and I thought I've run out of everything else I obviously haven't now because I've stocked up on loads of stuff but I've been using these are my second bottles of these so I've got a curl care shampoo and a curl care conditioner I cannot believe the difference that both of these have made to my hair. They're just such a lovely experience to use. I feel that my hair just had a lot more bounce and comfort and control. So, you know, I can't remember the pricing. I'll kind of pop details below, but Hask, definitely a brand to watch out for and try. Um, you know, I'm keen to try other things in their range as well. Another really beautiful, will always look nice on the side of your bath range, in a sense. Again, a hydrating cream hair bath and a hydrating cream conditioner. As they're kind of saying, this is more about, you know, if you're kind of feeling your hair's a bit dry, a bit brittle, needs that boost of hydration. These two do that perfectly. Again, doesn't matter whether it's, you know, thick hair or fine hair. Nice textures, you know, easy to use, uh, and they do look beautiful in your bathroom. Another rescue product that, again, I found on my online food shopping, it's called Happy Naturals. I was feeling that my hair had got a little bit, uh, I don't know, it just lost it, its bounce and feeling a bit dry. And this is kind of where I ended up investing in some different products to, to try to kind of give my hair back its life. You know, I'm, I'm very menopausal. My hair, I've noticed, is really, really affected by that. Happy Naturals, I wanted a mask. 
Uh, it's got argan and avocado oil in. I literally take big scoops out of it and slather my hair in it and then rinse it out. I was a little bit cautious to start with because I know when I've used hair masks before, they can kind of, you rinse them and then you almost need to shampoo and rinse, you know, thoroughly again because there's just that residue in the hair that isn't with this. And the, after the first time I used this, I got so many compliments uh, of my hair when I was kind of next at meetings. So this has become a bit of a go-to for just bringing that life back into my hair. 97% uh, natural, so that's happy naturals. So that is all about my, my cleansing of my hair. Styling, I think if you want your hair to look, look good, look nice, look healthy, actually your styling products can be a real key to making that happen. Because I can kind of wash and condition my hair and it can still kind of sometimes get a little bit of that fur if I haven't styled it properly. So I've got quite a few that are my go-tos and they're all slightly different. I am gonna start with The Ordinary. It's not a brand that I kind of usually engage with, but for example, with my hair, I was really struggling. I was actually losing quite a bit of hair and I'd lost that thickness and fullness. So again, I got onto Google as all of us do and I came across some really great reviews for The Ordinary, their multi-peptide serum. This is, has been actually quite a hair changer. So I kind of wash and shampoo my hair, then I'm kind of putting probably a full pipette of that and I'm massaging it into my scalp. I have been using it for, I'm gonna say about six to eight weeks. I can definitely see a difference. Thicker, fuller hair, uh, this has definitely been a hair changer. Um, so that's not necessarily styling, that's actually getting some health back in your hair. If I want to put something in to damp hair, to then either go to bed with wet hair and then style it in the morning, or to style it there and then, uh, a couple of my go-tos, I've got Living Proof, it's a five-in-one styling treatment. I'm not exactly sure what the five-in-one is. It's a nice cream texture, run it through the ends of hair, and then I do find it's just easier to style. I can't even pronounce the name of this, uh, Aveda. It's kind of, I used to, so I was a child of the 80s and we used to consume hair foam and stuff, uh, you know, and your hair would be all crispy. This isn't one of those. It foams because of the action of the pump and it's just a really great styling, gentle foam. I find it just, actually this is kind of, when I went to bed last night with wet hair, this is exactly what I put, on, put in last night. Uh, and I find I just kind of then run it through, massage it in slightly, and then it's kind of taking off some of the, the furriness and just helps with that styling process. If I want to put something in my hair, I've washed it, I've styled it, I then want to put something in it to kind of, whether it's add some texture or separate it out. I've got a couple of go-tos. Larry King, who I go to his salon in central London, uh, as you can see, I've used this a lot. It is called A Social Life for Your Hair. This is amazing. You can layer it up, you can use a small amount. It's quite a thick cream. One of the only things I'd say about the packaging is when you squish it out, you've got to put the lid back on quickly or it keeps squishing out. You can, you know, through the ends, take some fur off the top. I find that I can reapply it throughout the day as well. So that has been an absolute must in my, my hair routine. It, it travels with me as well, so great for all hair types. Another fab product which I came across in New Zealand a few months ago, it's called Frizz Be Gone. This is, it's that old school um, lightweight serum, but I find it's brilliant for adding a little bit of gloss without too much oil. What I have found I'm doing is doing a little bit of my hair frisbee gone and combining it with my Larry King. Mixing that together, getting it nice and warm and then working that through my hair. And I find that combo uh, just seems to work really nicely. If I then want to add a little bit of extra oomph or maybe kind of a bit of staying power with the style. I will then use uh, a hairspray, Living Proof Perfect Hair Days Bodybuilder. 
I might just give a little bit of a an all round to hold it or I will add it underneath to add some volume. I do occasionally still like to do a bit of a back comb up here to add a bit of volume. With my work, I don't always get time to wash my hair, so a dry shampoo is an essential. The only one I will actually use is a bader. It's a dry shampoo, it's called shampoo. You squeeze it, and it comes out. It smells beautiful. I'm sure there's a whole load of aromatherapy in here. I'm not going to use it now, but I would literally, and then give it a, a squish, mix it in as you would most dry shampoos. And again, it can add a volume. It means that my hair will last another day. <laughs> yeah, so those are my, those are my kind of hair must have products. I hope you found that helpful. If you've got any questions, please put them below. And if you've got any recommendations for natural hair products, I always love a good recommendation.